All right, yeah, guys, we went to the hotel. Vipers for review. Today, I got Chips Ahoy Red Grape. Now, I had to search this out because these grapes look a little bit like cranberries, mainly because of the color. So, yeah. Hell, even my father got confused if it was grapes or cranberries. I had to, I had to search it up, and it, it turned out that this is the this is grape flavor. This is red grape. So yeah. But it damn sure looks like cranberries though. And this comes from China. So as you can tell by the by the logo of the Chips Hoy logo, that's it. The language is in is in Chinese, bro. So yeah. With the English wording for the shit appearing right here, bro. This is the only place that reveals the logo in English, bro. So, yeah. Now, I've tried Chips Hoy flavors from this country before. I remember I tried, like, the cranberry flavor and I think the matcha flavor, I think. I don't remember. So, yeah. And now, I'm about to try its grape flavor, so... So yeah, I'm gonna try opening it. And how come we can't? Before I open it, how come we can't get these cookie mascots in the U.S., bro? Like they look so cool. Come on, come on, Mondellis slash Chips Ahoy. And before you ask, Mondellis is the company that owns Chips Ahoy. So come on, Mondellis, you could have at least gave us these mascots for. For the U.S., these 2D mascots. Sure, I know, I know, I know. We already have mascots that's in 3D in the U.S., but still. How come certain shit in different countries is better than the ones in the U.S., bro? Like, that ass. Like, they be having, like, anime-related food, food slash drink products in places like Japan. But they, but they rarely have ever do that in the U.S. Okay, I know, I know, they do it in the U.S. But, but only in places like Fye, bro. So, so yeah. Or in several stores, and look how it looks. And honestly. It kind of, it looks nothing like the packaging, bro. You can see that there's hints of red in the packaging. But here, but here, but here it looks nothing like the, what's on the packaging. So, yeah, so it's kind of false advertising in my opinion, bro. Like I hate false advertising because because of the pro because it tells you that the puck does not that's on the cover or in advertisements is not in the game. So yeah. So yeah, I was so yeah. Let's try a shit. Okay, I was I was saying uh see it doesn't match the image on the packaging. So yeah. Hey, hey, hey. Yeah. I'm gonna taste some grape in it. Tastes alright. It's essentially been turned into raisins basically. Which is dried up grapes so it tastes pretty good. Alright, going to try this for sales, guys. So, I'll see you guys next time for RSTV. Sign off.